Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Assalam. How are you, dear teacher? Ah, Alhamdulillah, I am fine. And how about you? I am fine and healthy, and I hope you will be fine and healthy. Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Okay, okay. so you uh, send me a, a Excel file. This Excel file, yes, uh, uh, you want to import in Google Earth Engine, yeah? Yes, so I have some points I want to import in Google Earth Engine, and it's not showing me in, in Afghanistan. I don't know what's the problem. Okay, let me try from my side. I just simply share my screen and try to import this Excel file. Yeah. And further, I will try to explain what the problem about that. Okay, okay so let me share my screen. Yes, share. So now can you see my screen? Is it visible? Can you see my skin? Yeah, please. No, it's in in the during the visibility yes okay. now it's visible now see yes yes i see yes. okay <clears throat> Green. so this is your file excel file you send me okay and this excel file you including some on our order column and basically this is our main focus yes. latitude and longitude okay yes so first of all, this file, I need to make the CSV file. So just click on the file option. Here you can see about the save as. And click on the, suppose I just save in my uh, download folder. Uh, I just simply download, so I simply select. And I want to just uh, uh, make it the CSV, okay? From a delimited uh, file, CSV. Okay, yeah. so just further, I simply just click for the save it. Yes. Okay, so now I simply open my Google Earth Engine and here you can see the asset tab. Click on the new and click on the CSV. Yeah. So now further I just click on the source file. Yes, yes. And you can see my CSV file. This is my CSV file. Yes. Yeah. Simply select that. Yeah. And further I have to add the column name. So here you can see about that. CSV file, uh, yes. Two column x column longitude y column latitude i have to use the same name yeah. of my column so i simply copy that yeah. suppose gps longitude i simply copy and then i paste in my column name in here longitude and save as for latitude i simply copy the same name from here that gps lat simply copy this name and further paste in my y column so after doing these things in this time, yeah. all of them the same, just click the upload. So now our task will be running. So it takes one minute, yeah. or less than one minute. Then we try to open this point shape file in our map. You can see it will be working. So now let's check what happened. Okay, done. So for that, I just click on the refresh button. Here I find out the GPS yeah. points. Just click on here. 
Yes. And from here, I can get this attribute table. So basically, this information I want to add in here. So here you can see about that. Okay. okay so let me try and open it. What happened? I can check. So just put add map dot add layer. I call the table and also map dot center object. I call the table and stain and click the one. So now it focus my study area. Okay. So is it interpret the wrong area? Wrong location? Yeah. Okay, so I think you have problem this type of values. Yeah. So this yeah. type of values I think problem. Suppose I click on here and click on here. So now, okay, just I simply, because I check the value from here, what's the value about that? Suppose I just click on this map. So it's about that you can see 34.1669. So we can get this type of value. So we can find out that. latitude is that 69 yeah, 69 69 and yeah. longitude 34 okay 34 something about that yeah so in this time it, it show about that same location okay suppose when i check the point from also from here we can get the same location about that okay so now you we have to put the exact location suppose i think your coordinate have some problem about that it can be negative or positive okay so let me try suppose it's the province capital of lahore the province capital of lahore. Logar. sorry logar province logar logar so is yeah. it one kind of yeah. uh, uh, city yeah yes okay. it's in the city of one it's the province of afghanistan oh let me check just a minute the province Capital okay, Logar. Logar province. Province. Yeah. Let it soon and long it. You can check the value. Then you can get that better idea about that. So it's about that 34.146 north and 69.1924 degree east. Okay. So Thirty-four. It's for the thirty-four. Be not Logar. Okay. So I'll check from here. Suppose I simply search here. Logar. Logar, Afghanistan. Yeah. Suppose. No. Uh, sorry, there is the Puli Alam, it is the center of Lugar. Where it is? Kabul. Yeah. Sorry, teacher, go up, go up. And Lugar is nearest the Kabul. No, 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 go down, go down, go down. Continue. Like that. Continue. This is the Mahmoud and this is the Lugar province. Puli Alam is the center of Lugar. Can you hear me, teacher? Yeah, I can hear, yeah. 
Pulliyaram is the center of Logar. Pulli is it? Yes, yes, this is the center of Logar. Okay, I check it. Suppose if longitude can get to 69.01. 69, let me do 34. Okay, so, okay, you, you make the mistake in here. Okay, so if your data is okay. <clears throat> in this time, it will be GPS long and it will be GPS yeah. length. Okay, so now it will be okay. Okay, so now try me again about that. I hope it will work. So just I run the code again and I simply import the file again in my study area. So just I simply remove the previous one. So just click on here and I delete it. Delete and further again. So just CSV. I source that yeah. this file which I save and then further put here this thing. Suppose I simply copy the GPS long and put here that yeah. longitude and same as for GPS lat and copy in my latitude. Okay, now upload again. Now I hope it will work. So now it's working. Sorry, right, teacher. Yeah, please. Uh, you sent me the course content for uh, QJS. Yeah, yeah. And, and you don't uh, write it the fee about the course content. Okay, so if you want, you can also add uh, something about new course content. Suppose you have also sent me that. Basically, we also uh, focus on the student interest. Okay. Suppose you have, have any specific course content, then you can also send me that. I also add it, no problem. Okay, so I simply import mm -hmm. that. Yeah. And then check what happened about now. Okay, just click the run. So now it will be right. So we can get that exact location, all of point in that your study area in Afghanistan. Okay. Yes. So now it's fine. The first time it make the mistake because you just put at that long, uh, suppose longitude, you can put the latitude and latitude put the longitude. So that's why first time it not work. It's for the other study area. But when I just simply change the column name, now it will be really working out then. Okay. So you'll surprise how we can yeah. get this. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Have a good day. Okay. Have a good day. Goodbye. Okay, bye.